Hi guys and welcome back to some more Orcs Must Die Unchained. We are back with the weekly challenge. This one is one and done on restricted section. We only have one rift point to uh, do this map in. So quite a tricky one. Um, I just tried it and somehow one runner like slipped all the way past. So I'm pathing this the same as I normally do in Rift Lord. Somehow a runner snuck all the way through and um, got to the rift, so failed right at the end. I don't know if I'll do a fail video for this one, but if I keep failing more like that, um, then I probably will. So to start off, um, as I said, setting it up pretty much the same as I set it up for Rift Lord runs on, uh, on a restricted section. I actually love this map. First time I got here, I hated it, but... Uh, after playing it a few times and getting some better traps and account level and stuff, I actually really like it now. It is a lot of fun. Now, I can't actually remember how I did last time. I don't actually have a recording of this one. So this is the first time this weekly challenge will be recorded and up on the channel. Um, hopefully the 10 minute part time. Last time I did it, uh, where I failed by one, the only one I had, um, I did get there in time. Um, just one ran through right at the end, the very last. I just completely missed him, and then uh, saw that pesky little red dot run into the uh, run into the mini map there. Hopefully this time around, though, no mistakes, because you can't afford any mistakes on this one. And we'll uh, we'll be able to get that five star. Now, first off, I am starting with Zoe. We have. Master, War Mage, and Apprentice characters. So Cygnus is the Master. Max is the War Mage, and Zoe is the Apprentice. Um, it's kind of like the in-house game modes or in-house names for the heroes, uh, if you weren't aware. Um, so I've got them. Now starting off with. Starting off, uh, obviously, with Zoe, and we'll hopefully get a time, uh, get a chance to get the others done as well, and hopefully we'll be able to take out this guy too. So I want that extra coin. Oh damn! Actually, the first time I haven't, uh, I haven't killed him. I think chasing after those, I was chasing down those runners, and I uh, couldn't put enough time. Didn't put enough time to, uh... Damn, pesky exploders. They're so annoying. Might actually get a chance to be able to put this back. Oh, I would've. If it, uh... If I didn't fail epically there. Oh, well. Not a really good start. Hopefully, uh... Hopefully I improve. That was not a not a good start at all. It's not what I wanted. Oh, want to make sure that those grenade guys don't hit any of our barricades. That's fine. That other barricade can be destroyed. I'll replace those shortly. Oh, why have I placed all those tar there? Did I have tar selected instead? Wow. Even more fails. More fails I didn't even know about there, guys. Way too many tar. I mean, tar's awesome, but that's way too many. Okay, I need to fix up this stuff quickly now. We can uh, skip the break. Okay, that, get rid of that. I'm not putting a Guardian down, um, even though we can afford one on this side. I don't want him taking any aggro from any grenade guys or exploders or anything like that. I Actually, exploders would be alright, but not from any um, grenade guys. Okay, that'll do for starters. Let's put that there as well. Yeah, that's pretty much how the pathing is going to be set up. I am going to add more pathing to path them past the priest as well, which I'll do shortly. 
But then bottlenecking along this path um, actually works out quite well. At least so I find uh, with this map anyway, if you've not played this map before, it can be quite a tricky one. Let's pop that there as well. Hey, very nice. Pop a couple. There's also a bug there for some reason. You can't place a trap over those two tiles. Um, I'm not sure if the devs know about that or not. If I move that one down, I can. It's fine, but I can't place it over those uh, two tiles there, which is definitely a mistake. I uh, shouldn't be doing that. Hey, okay, very nice wave is complete. Now I want to um, put the guardian back in place here. Throw a couple more traps in here. Now on the next, on the next wave, we've got the other door opening, so I want to set up traps down here. So I'm going to just get start to get that prepared. Um, and I'm also going to come up here and I don't know what comes out of these, but I don't want to risk it. Oh, they're hurting quite a lot. Oh, very nice. Having them path past the priest there will definitely help out. Defensive Guardian's fallen again. That's okay. We can um, we can replace him. So that is a nice change that we now have. Um, we can replace those guardians. Yeah, let's get that done. What have we got? One ogre coming through here. Go. So, very nice. Oh, 2,000 now. They are getting expensive. I don't actually have the coin for that yet. So, unfortunately for now, um, not going to be able to replace him, fortunately. But that's okay. Just going to come down here and bend this section as much as possible. Okay, things going pretty well so far. Oi, pesky runners. Don't want those pesky runners getting through. They ruin your day very quickly. Put up a, a blister as well. Might help take out the one or two that might slip through. Ideally, we don't want any going through, but... Actually, put some more slows along here. Okay, up to the final wave. No mistakes yet, but there's still time, guys. I made uh, I made a really bad mistake at the last one, so definitely still possible. I don't want it to happen, but it's definitely still possible. Hey, in case they cut that corner, I'm going to put that there. Oh, boss minion coming out. Uh, that rift location is actually pretty nice. Um, might leave it. Time-wise, we've still got two minutes to finish this wave. Definitely focusing this side first. Okay, those exploders coming out that side, we've actually got barricades there that will distract them, so that actually worked out quite nicely. That actually worked out really well for us. And um, we've got one dude to go. This time, no mistakes, thank goodness. Um, didn't let one of those pesky runners slip through this time around, which is awesome. 
got the five star. You can actually only get four star, five star, or no stars on this particular weekly challenge. Uh, but I hope you guys did enjoy it. As soon as I get a chance to do the Max and Cygnus runs, I'll pop links to those down below as well. As always, if you enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, like what you see, hit that subscribe button. Hope to catch you all in the rift.